Hey you, yes you, do you want to know how to get a win streak of 10 or more the Odilla way? Then watch the video all the way through to find out. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel Odilla Me and today, today I'm be doing a how to get a 10 win streak or more Odilla style type of video. If you guys seen the beginning, I'm pretty sure my friend Celestio is gonna like do some like cringy fucking intro for me, so that would be funny. Holy shit. Oh my god, that was actually pretty cool. Okay, so basically someone asked me for like a tips and tricks video on like how to level up fast, but that's basically just like finishing all your quests. But I feel like I do play- I don't really play differently from other people, but I kind of play rushy but like also smart at the same time the one thing that i do differently from other youtubers is that when you have four diamonds i buy prot trap and heal pool and then after i get four more diamonds i buy prot too because i feel like if you have good pvp skills then it'd be better to buy prot too you know like less damage but if you feel like you're not that good at pvp then you should buy sharp obviously and usually in solo bed wars there's really no need for a bed defense because even in, like even if you're not there like who's gonna protect it i mean if you have like endstone wood wood will all that and you have a trap then you should be fine to void but not really did he bridge or is he yeah i knew he was hiding okay good fight i feel like it'll be better explained when i'm like playing on a fast iron map to show you like what defense i do sometimes i use unstone sometimes i just use one layer of wool Ooh, jesus okay good fight and if you think you're not that good at pvp which i thought before in the past then you should definitely grind some classic duels classic duels in sumo is like the easiest way to like learn how to get better at pvp which is what i did i think i'm like classic master 2 right now and i play almost five every day usually just to finish my quest but i don't know it's really good to like learn w tapping and all the other techniques but i honestly think i play more differently when it's like a fast iron map okay gg good fight as you can see i'm on an 11 win streak i tried to get 10 like i played 10 games in a row before i started recording because i wanted to show you guys like because usually i do have a bit of a high win streak yesterday i had 28 but i lost it when i was playing threes and yeah that's why i have a zero win streak in threes but six and fours 11 and double 11 solos i mean solos is really easy so like i'm just gonna show you guys how i play solos i guess Okay, hey guys, welcome to the second game. Now I'm gonna show you guys how I play on a fast iron map, or not really fast iron, but a bigger map. I usually love to get full set of tools. Shears is like really helpful, considering that like, you can still break the bed even if they're like around it because of how fast it breaks, obviously. And I like to bridge high, so it like takes my opponent longer to like get to my base. But also you're gonna take a lot more fall damage, so it's really good to buy some ladders, but like, I don't think I'm that good at ladder clutching. I think he fell died right okay i don't think i have enough blocks to get here but um it's okay we have a tnt oh yeah we do have a tnt it's fine i got him wait there's no way i got him like that wait i thought i was gonna die okay don't do that guys obviously don't bridge that high i thought he was i thought he was gonna keep on bridging obviously if you want to play more defensive go for diamonds but since my other rush is still fighting their first rush and i'm gonna go for yellow because they did get out green i'm just gonna sit here and wait for them to leave actually and i'm sorry if i'm talking fast i'm just i don't know i was trying to record like two other videos earlier and i got so irritated because people kept like making noises and i kind of just want to get a video out because i do enjoy uploading it's just i have no ideas you know and obviously you're gonna have to learn how to speed bridge there's no way i mean some people win if they slow bridge but it's so much slower and how to level up fast is just oh, they don't even know oh wait wait did i get him okay good but the way of leveling up fast i mean you do get a lot more xp if the games are like they take a bit longer but i feel like if you just play a bunch of games and they go by fast then you can also finish a bunch of quests too and gray and red will most likely fight because they're closer to each other but one of them could target me because i've been getting i got two people out i don't know if that's a threat to them or anything but i think i have a trap so i should know my bed's gonna get destroyed okay red's at min he's probably gonna go for my bed assuming that he thinks i'm gonna go for his actually i'm just gonna go straight for his and see if i can void in time because gray could also be going for my bed yeah gray's at my bed right now no that's fine that's totally fine so all of a sudden everyone wants to go mid 
probably a bad idea, but... That was not safe. I think Red's gonna get his bed though. Do not do what I did. I just thought I could get gray bed. Um, that was really scary. I almost died there. But Red's about to get his bed, I think. So I should be fine. Unless I don't know where Red went. Do not do what I did. I like I like playing scary sometimes, but like I'm also kind of smart about it. I guess it's a good way to show like how I clutch as well, because I love getting emeralds and I love getting like prot two and sharp and stuff. Oh my god. I don't even have armor, no wonder why he wanted me so bad. Oh my god, I thought I had armor this whole time. What the fuck? No wonder why I took so much damage too. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. I like going Emma's a lot. Yes, I'm a pussy, but like... I mean, obviously jump and all that stuff is useful, but... I like buying a bunch of invis. The smart thing for me to do would be like get prod 3. But I'm... I'm gonna buy a track on him real quick before I do that. If I plan on doing it. He dropped down. Oh my god. Okay, that was scary. Did I do what I did? Okay, I think I'm just gonna play two games because I feel like I did play in a small map. Not really a small map, but like maps where the bases are closer together, which was Lighthouse. And then I played on Ambush. It was like a more spread it out map and it was fast iron. And sometimes I use Endstone as defense or I use like one layer of wool, which it really doesn't matter. My bed got destroyed either way because I wasn't there to protect it. But if you want to level up fast as well, make sure you do all your quests, all the dailies. And if you want to do some bedwear challenges and solos, then I recommend the Selfish Challenge. I think that one's the easiest or you can do collect which i think that takes a lot more time um selfish is where you can't drop anything or use any of your chests so i think that one's the easiest for solos and um yeah just make sure you do all your quests level up fast and then don't really play how i play i played more scary there but it's okay that's how i got my 28 win streak like yesterday and now i'm gonna get it back because i was mad that i lost so yeah you guys have a good day i love you okay bye